just up here. Ah, I've seen you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Here. Agora eu vou levar vocês para uma missão. Eu vou visitar uma casa com o Jandir e a Stefania, um apartamento que eles acharam. Coincidentemente, é no, deve ser no mesmo prédio que eu morei, aqui do lado. E, e eu vou levar a câmera, claro que eu vou tentar dar uma disfarçada, começar... Tirando esse microfone, tirando esse tripod. E vou levar só a câmera como se eu fosse um fotógrafo amador. <risos> Vamos ver no que que dá. Ó, só para vocês terem uma, uma noção, a minha casa é aqui, né? Aqui essa, essa de cor de creme aqui. E eu morava ali. Aquele muro de pedras ali, ó. Eu morava ali, do outro lado daquele muro, naquelas né? casas. Na verdade é um pouquinho mais para esquerda. Que eu sei lá por que raios aqui os irlandeses eles ficam dividindo as ruas com muros. Como se fosse condomínio, então dá todo um trampo pra dar a volta nos bairros aqui. Eu morava, eu morava neste prédio aqui, ó. Acho que vocês já devem ter visto vídeos. Acabei de mandar uma mensagem pro Jandir, porque ele não tava atendendo o telefone. Para avisar ele que os irlandeses não admitem atraso, não toleram, eles acham uma falta de respeito. Então a chance dele perder a vaga seria bem grande. Fala garoto, você tá longe? Ah, tá bom, então tá, eu tô aqui na, tô aqui na esquina da, desse prédio aí que você tá vendo então. I think good afternoon. I'm Kawe. How, how are you? Good. Janji, Stefania. Stefania. How are you? They're from Brazil. They came from to Brazil, learn right? English. And are you from Brazil? Yeah, I am Brazilian as well. You have to be able to speak Portuguese with a Brazilian accent. <laughs> <laughs> Is that correct? Yeah. How long are they here? Have they just arrived? Uh, one week. Oh, okay. So, yeah. so they okay. are in pro um, provisory accommodation. Okay, to, to temporary accommodation. Yeah. yeah, temporary accommodation. This is the living room slash kitchen here. Okay. So, so yeah. So, if you, um, are you already living this sister uh, here? I'm living in in Well Park with my wife. Uh -huh. I am an uh, international student agent. Okay. So I bring some students from Brazil to learn uh, English. Okay. I have some um, partnership with Atlantic School oh, on good. Bridge Mills language. Right. Do you know in town? And I do. I do. Yes. Uh, Cultural Institute in Salt Hill. Yeah. And. I got some students to bring to Brazil. No, I, I did some work for these companies because I do. Seriously, I do IT work. I used to look after their ah, server, their network. Nice. So you know Patrick from Ga uh, Gaia Language Bridge Mills. I think I do. Yeah. Yeah. But they are studying in Atlantic School. Okay. Do you know beside to the coach station? This is uh, the lady. What's her name? Uh, um, Colleen, not Colleen. Um, Rose. No, Rose. The woman who runs the place. I know this. The language school. Okay, it's a big school. Okay. Here is school, yeah. Yeah. Uh, how and many people are living here? Living okay. here right now, there's one Spanish guy. Okay. He speaks um, good English and good Spanish. Okay. <laughs> a professional guy? He's professional, yeah. He's, uh, okay. He works in an IT environment, but I think he's a translator as well. Ah, nice. He translates uh, between IT and okay. Paris. Okay. He's quite so a, that's a good, good food, at least. He's, he's, a, he's a lovely guy as well. <laughs> yeah, okay. He's a lovely guy, and he. Um, I never see him. He works until about 8:30 p.m. So he's okay. He's always away, you know. Yes, yes, yes. So there's one guy only. Well, well, only one guy. Well, there's, there was three people, and, and both of them were moving outside Galway. So all right. So now it's, right. there's only one, two rooms for free. Two rooms, two free. Room. Well, right now, not right now, but in the next week or two, there's one will be free tomorrow. Mm, because I, I I try to remember if I have someone else to looking for a room, but I, I don't think so. No, if it's okay. I, I, I've quite. A, I think somebody is taking the other room, but I'm not sure yeah. yet, so I can't make it. Yeah, just uh, yeah. But but how long does he want a room for? They need at least for eight months. Okay. But the plan is they would like to. The course is six months, right. and they have two more months to get holidays. Right. You know, but uh, the plan, the, the, their plan is uh, get a job because help with improving English 
and stay for renew the course for stay for two years. Okay. So, so at least went eight months at because least, the eight it. months visa they okay. have. Okay. Okay. You know? I understand. Yeah. I understand. Where in Brazil are they from? From Minas Gerais. Uh, is uh, the middle of the, the country. It's a huge uh, state, but it's a small city. But in Minas Gerais, we used to say, when you go there, you get five kilos fat. Right. Oh, no, I don't, I don't <laughs> because the food is very nice. I don't yeah. know that. I look very careful about my diet. You know? Yeah. <laughs> so I don't... <laughs> yeah, there has to be diet sometimes. Yeah, I no, I, I'd love to go there. So, uh, so, okay, so both in the same school? Yeah, yeah they are merged. Oh, they are merged. Yeah. Okay, super. So you look for one room <laughs> with one bed. Yeah, yeah one room. Actually, right. uh, just to tell about them, uh, there is no smoking, yep. there's no parties, they are sure. quiet, you know. Uh, so I think they're looking for someone similar. Okay. I don't I know think if you, the guy is smoking. This, 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 no, this is the same. The okay. guy doesn't smoke. He, I think he drinks, but not very much, like myself. Yeah, like it's not, not problem with alcohol, you know. <laughs> yeah, just a few drinks every now and then. <laughs> Uh, so that's, that's fine. I, well, I'll show you the rooms now. Yeah. This is, as I said, living room in the kitchen. Yeah, it's, it's a nice house. It's, it's lovely and bright, actually, isn't it? Yeah. In fact, I, I love this very much. Very nice. Nice, nice yeah. place. It's a good Especially thing. because of this. Yeah. And you have space to exactly. study. And what I like about this, it's not en suite. There's no bathroom here, but the bathroom is just next door. Yeah. So it's like similar. <laughs> yeah. Because most places, when you go when you go to accommodation, when you get the en suite, you usually pay more money. Yeah, yeah that's true, yeah. There's one more stairs. Ah. So the ensuite is, is like the ensuite, you know? <laughs> Oh, Jesus, this is a big house. It's big, yeah. There's it's more fun. rooms upstairs. There's two rooms upstairs, I'll show you upstairs. Oh, oh. Okay. Hmm? Yeah, it's a nice house. So this is where George is, a Spanish friend. And this is the other room that's free. Two beds. Yeah, two beds, and ensuite behind you. Ah, the bed. Yeah. But this room is more expensive. Can ah, okay, because they're in suite. Oh, absolutely, yes. Help but they say uh, we'll be able to rent, or? Uh, well, I think somebody is, is maybe taking this. I'm not sure yet. The other one is ah, okay, okay. More likely. But yeah. if, you, if, you, if you're more interested in this, I talk to the other person, because the other person is, is a, a single person. I, I don't know. Okay. Just wonder, how much is this room in the other one? Uh, the, what's, uh, what's the price? It's on the ad. I don't remember the price. Okay, it's, no uh, problem. It, the, the price is... Um, what is the price of this room? It's, it's, I'll, I'll check on the... Oh, computer. take your time. No I don't remember the information yeah. like this. Yeah, no problem. It's the same, it's whatever it is. It's, it's a little bit extra for the electricity here as well. You have to pay a little bit extra. Okay. Because the electricity is shared. Ah, uh, yes, yes, I the understand. Electricity bill. Yeah. yeah. But it's, it's not been a problem. The tenants, if you want to proof, they, they said it was very reasonable and it mm -hmm. wasn't expensive. The, over the rent wasn't. There wasn't many expenses over the rent, it was expensive. Yeah, I know, yeah, I can really make it. It's a, it's a new, new house. So it's quite warm, yeah, exactly. Warm, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Sorry, guys. Sorry for all yeah, this stuff. Yeah, take it. Go. Okay. Actually, I remember now, it's 475. Yeah. 475 and another one, 575 per month. 475, this per, room per here. Month, per calendar month, yeah. Okay, the plus the electric bills. Electricity bill, electricity bill, yeah. Okay. It will usually come out to be more or less than 500, I think, total. Okay, in total. In total, yeah. Um, so how many people currently? Uh, one. One people. But there will be usually three. In total. In total, yeah. Plus yeah three or maybe uh, no, two five them. with them. Ah, no, three two, with two, them. Three, three, no, no, two, uh, three. Uh, I played four maybe. One person with the other one. Okay. Uh, it's, it's, uh, this is my um, my summary, my expectation. One person takes the top room. All right. George, and then those two is four. Four people in total. Is there any chance we, we talk with the Spanish guy tonight or um, any time? I don't know. Just just to double yeah, check about I do, the bills. I do. The best thing I think is to is to um, I call. I'll see if I I call him later on this evening. Tonight's not good because he won't okay. be free tonight. But yeah. I'll call him maybe for before the weekend because there's no major mm -hmm. rush on this. They need to have an amount enough to stay for six months. I understand. Yeah. Do you know? So exactly. they have the money to stay for all the, I, the, the I, period, those two days. I have an email. Is that, is that your email? Did you, did you give me the email address? I wrote to them. <laughs> okay. So it's your email address? Yes, yeah, it's, it's him in mail, but I did the, the text. Well, I, I'll send you the email back about the details. And perfect, and, perfect. And, and then you can... Nice, nice. And, and I'll ask George, and if George says okay tonight, maybe I'll send you the email by tomorrow. Okay. And George is the Spanish guy. George is the Spanish guy. Nice, okay. Lovely guy. Yeah. And... and, and uh, then we, I give you the information you you just asked for, mm -hmm. like the, the full information about the rent, mm -hmm. and George will will give you exactly what it should cost then per month. Ah, that's for the amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, how long is minimum for contract? Uh, six months at the minimum. Six months minimum. Yeah. 
That's nice. That's nice. Right. Okay, thank you very That's much. Good. Okay. <laughs> Bom, eu deixei ali só alguns lances né, da, da negociação, da visita à casa, porque realmente ficou ali uns 50 minutos de conversação. Né? Então, como vocês puderam perceber, é muito importante que, você, que exista uma introdução, né, onde eu me apresentei como agente deles, uma pessoa que estava ali para ajudar no idioma, que eles vieram para estudar, mas que eram profissionais no Brasil, que precisaram que precisariam melhorar o inglês para conseguir algo melhor no Brasil, e por isso que eles estavam aqui na Irlanda, e que eles tinham condições de pagar, e porque isso tudo conta muito, né? Afinal, alugar uma casa ou um quarto aqui na, na Irlanda não é nada burocrático se comparado ao Brasil. Aqui a única as duas coisas que eles querem saber, se você tem dinheiro para pagar os aluguéis, e se você é um bom inquilino, né? Eles querem uma referência anterior de algum lugar que você já tenha morado aqui na Irlanda, para saber, para ligar para o landlord e perguntar se você não destrói a casa, se você não faz festa, enfim, essas coisas todas. É importante também lembrar que esse vídeo foi gravado já quase duas semanas atrás. No fim, o Jandir e a Stefania conseguiram a vaga. A vaga, inclusive, tinha dois quartos vagos e eles pegaram uma suíte, né? um quarto bem grandão com suíte. Mas olha só... No dia seguinte, quando eles mudaram, eles descobriram que um, dentro do guarda-roupa tinha mofo, tinha infiltração no teto, o colchão estava destruído e nada disso dava para ver antes porque ainda tinham as coisas do morador que, que se mudou agora no caso. Então estava tudo meio que camuflado. Então... Precisou, eu precisei entrar de novo em contato com o Landlord para exigir que ele fizesse toda a manutenção no quarto, né? Trocasse o guarda-roupa, trocasse o colchão, enfim, desse uma geral na casa porque a casa estava suja. Então, todas essas coisas é importante levar em consideração quando você vai alugar uma residência ou um quarto aqui na Irlanda. Tá certo? Bom, era só isso mesmo. Uh, não, não vamos prolongar muito o Daily Vlog porque... Eu vou editar esse vídeo agora, peço desculpas porque não teve o vídeo ontem, o fato é que eu conhe... eu... o McGregor lutou, né? o... o irlandês lutou no UFC na... nesse final de semana e na segunda-feira eu liguei para o Brian, que é um amigo que gosta de lutas, ele é um irlandês nascido aqui em Gal e que gosta muito de lutas. E eu liguei para tirar um sarro e tal, não sei o que... E fazia muitos meses já que a gente não se falava, então a gente combinou de se encontrar, a gente se encontra, encontram, nos encontramos ontem à tarde e o papo acabou se estendendo até altas horas da noite. Então eu pude conversar com ele várias coisas que as pessoas tinham já me perguntado, as pessoas que eu digo vocês aí do Brasil, sobre o que os irlandeses pensam do McGregor, se realmente o pessoal gosta dele, é, o que os irlandeses pensam, acham dos imigrantes, se eles gostam que tenha imigrantes no país, enfim. Várias coisas eu conversei e eu posso colocar no vídeo para vocês, no vídeo de amanhã ou no de sexta. Como não teve vídeo na terça, eu vou recompensar e vou fazer um vídeo na sexta, tá bom? Então é isso. Nos vemos amanhã, um abraço, cheers!